Hello children, welcome back. Children, in the previous video, we all had revised number 1 and number 4. Now today, in the similar manner, we are going to revise number 7 and number 10. Okay, so now look here and tell me how many fingers am I showing you? Okay, let us all count. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Yes, seven fingers. You all show me a seven fingers. Yay! Seven fingers means which number? Seven finger means uh, number six. No, seven fingers. Seven number. Yes. And similarly, number ten means how many objects? Ten. So, let's count this marker. Count. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. So, how many markers, ma'am? Has ten markers. Ten markers means which number? Ten markers means number ten. Okay. So now you all show me a ten fingers. Yes. Ten fingers. Now quickly show me a seven fingers. Close three fingers. Close three fingers and show me seven fingers. Yes. Now quickly show me ten fingers. Seven fingers. Ten fingers. Okay. Now let's recall how to write number seven. And number 10. Let's start with the patterns. So this is a standing line, slipping line, slanting line, forward and slanting line, backward. Okay. Now with the help of slipping line and slanting line backward, we are going to form number 7. So, how to write number 7? Sleeping line and a slanting line backward. Sleeping line, slanting line, backward number 7. Once more, sleeping line, slanting line, backward number 7. Now, for 7, how many balls? Count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 balls. Number 7. Now, Let's see how to write number 10. So here we are going to use pattern standing line number 1. Then big oval is 0. Standing line number 1 and 0. 1, 0, 10. So, how are we going to write 0? Are we supposed to write 0 from right side? Wrong. How are we supposed to write? We should take curve from the left side. Then turn and go up and touch. This is how we supposed to form a 0. So, 1... 1, 0, 10. For 10, how many balls? Count. 
वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवेन एट नाइन एंड वन जीरो टेन नंबर टेन टेन बॉल्स I hope you all have practiced writing number one and number four in the notebook, as I told you last time. So similarly, children, practice writing number seven and number ten in the square notebook by leaving one one squares. Bye.